What I like the most is the fun activities that they do. Uh, I like that you get to meet new people and see my friends every day. You learn new things when you do the activities. We were tie-dyeing um, some t-shirts. We're learning like how like the materials stick and like what works and what doesn't. Mix up the colours and like ways you like twist it around. And I think that was my favourite one so far. You experience new things that you haven't done before. Te Whare Wanaka o Araki, or Lincoln University, is really proud to partner with Girl Guiding New Zealand with this badge. It helps promote the food and fibre sector and the opportunities available in New Zealand, and it also teaches students where food comes from, and that's really important. In 2020, we surveyed our girls and we found out that they were interested in agriculture, science, animals and the environment. So we joined up with expert partners at Lincoln University to develop Growing the Future badge, which covers these areas of interest. Lincoln University is a land-based university, which means that we specialise in areas such as agriculture, horticulture, viticulture and environmental management. We also use our teaching and research to assist with the development of this badge, which is really exciting. And the girls are really enjoying the Growing the Future badge because it gives them a lot of variety. They're learning things about soil, to learning about fabrics and we've also learned about uh, careers in the agriculture industry. They've learned about things they might not normally learn about. Girl Guardians New Zealand's mission is to empower girls to take action to create a better world. We do this by using fun and adventure and activities that provide them with life skills and confidence and self-esteem. Yeah, so one of the most awesome things about Girl Guiding New Zealand is that girls get to experience things they don't necessarily get to in a school environment. These experiences are new and they can also learn about maybe something that they might want to have a career in later in life. It's extremely rewarding to see the young women learn about things like where their food comes from, the benefit of using natural materials and how to protect our environment. And hopefully from there, they'll be able to understand some of the career opportunities available in the land-based sector.